Boston Bros is number one thing not. You're dead wrong. You can catch me doing Miss McKinney with my prodders on. It's real boxing talk every time we meet with Ned, the TBE, and Conspiracy G. We bring it to you raw, on bias. You know the deal. You can even get a poor dealy here from Dollar Bill with my guys by my side. You know we going live. All we need you to do is please like and subscribe. Boxing Bros. Peace. The next topic we're going to discuss on Boxing Bros is the fight that looks like it's going to be ordered for the interim WBO championship. That is Alexander Usyk versus Joe Joyce. Uh, Joe Joyce had a few things to say about the fight when he was uh, interviewed by IFL TV. Take a listen. A lot of people, you know, will be going back to YouTube and watching that first fight between yourself and Alexander Usyk and the amateurs, which you referred to. Why is it turned around different this time, Joe? Um, I, I, I always say I, I cringe watching it back because, but it, you know, it was a good, exciting fight. We had plenty of exchanges. It was pretty close at the end. Of, uh, at the end, it went five rounds, all action, five rounds as well. So that's you know, we can do that over twelve. Ultimately, what will it come down to uh, and lead to victory for yourself? Sorry. Ultimately, what will it come down to? Why do you believe you're gonna? Yeah, come out on top against Alexander Usyk. Well, because he's going to have to deal with me for 12 rounds, not five. <laughs> and like with them pro gloves and like obviously all the skills I've learned as well along the way, they're definitely going to play di dividends and um, and also I have the you know the best camp and sparring, South Force sparring, so I'll be ready. Do you believe uh, your size, your physicality um, will run Usyk down? It will be too much for him. Yeah, so like I, I watched that fight with, with um, against Usyk. I mean, uh, Chisora against Usyk, that fight, and I thought um, Chisora did well. He was, you know, he, he put, he gave it his all, and it was a close fight. But um, where Usyk was a little bit more nimble and on his footwork and on his bike and moving around the ring, it was like just stealing off him. And I think I'm, you know, a bigger specimen. I'm six six, and I've got faster feet so it's going to be a lot you know a lot better fight but I think I've, I've got the tools to do the job do you think you stop it? yeah I, I think so we got a little message for Alexander Usyk Usyk I'm coming Usyk <laughs> see that video of him yesterday yeah so that's what he had to say about Usyk but meanwhile this is Usyk <laughs> Walking in some freezing cold water. He's getting baptized. So there you have it. Um, Joe Joyce feels like it's going to be a different fight. He feels like he can stop Usyk. Sure, though, Bill, what's your thoughts on the fight being announced? And do you agree with uh, Joe Joyce's assessment of the rematch? Well, basically, him fighting Usyk again. Um, I think it's a cool fight. I think it's a cool fight. Well, I think um, Joe Joyce's assessment is is pretty cool. Um, and I here's here's my assessment. I think that that. Joe Joyce, everything Joe Joyce said about himself, I agree. But I, I, I think I don't want him to underestimate the the moving ability and also the punch selection from um, a Usyk. Joe Joyce is is can move a little better on his feet, but his hands are slow, very slow to a uh, Usyk. I actually would favor Usyk going the distance as long as he doesn't talk about Joe Joyce's mama. <laughs> If he, <laughs> I have Usyk winning the twelve round fight. If he doesn't say anything bad <laughs> about Joe Joyce's mom, I couldn't imagine Usyk doing that. But <laughs> <laughs> Usyk wouldn't do that. 
But if he slips, <laughs> that will cost him. <laughs> but nah, um, you know, kudos to both gentlemen. Um, you know, I know Usyk is is really um confident in his abilities, and and shout out to him. You know, taking his spirituality to the level uh, to a, a, a new level, getting baptized. So salute to that. You know, um, can't fall suit to somebody for their beliefs. I think it's dope. And then um, shout out to um, Joe Joy. He's very confident. You know. Is very confident and he feels like he can win and that's what you want to hear from a young young fighter you know what i'm saying that he can well not too so young but that's what you want to hear from a fighter you don't want to hear you know what i'm saying saying oh you know maybe you know he thinks that he can go in there and stop him you know and he's very confident in his abilities and that's what you like to hear all right g i agree one thousand percent with what george joyce was saying like i honestly believe that this fight, Usyk's gonna get knocked out, and the reason why is because oh gee, whoa, he out, he out the window, oh. he jumped out the window. <laughs> Let me see him. Two things: when they fought back in the days, that was a smaller George Joyce, fewer rounds. Now we're we're talking about a more solid, more dense George Joyce, longer rounds. This guy absorbs so much that he's literally the juggernaut. Usyk's last performance against Chisora, I wasn't impressed at all. Like, even though he pulled off the victory, to me, I was like, bruh, like, Chisora's like, he's literally a gatekeeper. Like, I I'm be honest, and I like Chisora, but we all know Chisora got an endurance problem. You know, his stamina ain't the best. You know what I mean? So, yeah. with Joyce, one thing about Joyce, he may be slow, but he's excellent at cutting off the ring and them punches hurt. So when they land, it's a different type of feeling. So Usyk may, he may last, you know, five rounds running around trying to avoid them punches. I don't think he can do that for the whole 12 though. That's the difference. You it's know, two different fighters though. You're thinking, you're looking at Usyk going against a, Chishore. And listen, I give uh Chishore, I I know I'm messing his name. I give him a hard time. You know what I'm saying? But come on, uh, and like you know what I'm saying? It's just two different. It's just it's just it's just two different. I think like I agree with you though. Joe Joyce has gotten different, but so hasn't Usyk. Usyk has been learning and getting better as well. You know I what I'm saying? He's better. Me, you don't think he's getting better? You don't think Usyk has gotten better? And heavyweight, nah, bro. I'm be honest. At heavyweight, he ain't popping, son. He, you know what I'm saying? He's not popping at heavyweight. All right, hold. Let's just let's just clarify, G. G, right. right now, on the table, today, right now, before the fight is even signed, are you picking Joe Joyce to stop Alexander Usyk? Easy money, son. Easy oh, money. He's <laughs> Yo, listen, I promise y'all Usyk don't want those problems, B. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what Usyk wanted? He just wanted to pay that. <laughs> I don't think he thought he could be AJ. So what's gonna happen is he gonna go up in there, <laughs> to the WBO, and get. Oh my back. goodness! And next thing you know, we're gonna see George Joyce versus AJ or something. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm just saying, it's official. G's official pick is in today. Already, no, George Joyce by stoppage against uh, Alexander Usyk. Everyone, yo, fellas, I promise y'all this. I gotta understand, Usyk ain't solid in the heavyweight division. And when he was fighting against Chisora, every time he like took a shot, hey, he was moving. Like, I'm I like, agree. I was with you. I was, I like, was with you on that. But this is different. Yeah, but right. think about this. If Chisora's hits was making this dude fly across the ring, what you think gonna happen when George Joyce starts landing punches on him? That's all I'm saying. Like, and I get it, Joyce is a little slow. We all know this. However, he's great at cutting off the ring. Usyk's footwork, I would love to see this Usyk fighting against this more experienced Joe Joyce. The old Joe Joyce, like, yeah, you was doing your thing, Usyk. You ain't going to pull off half those things that you were going to do now. And another thing that Joe Joyce said that was key is like, yo, I'm going to have a real training camp with South Paws to prepare. That, to me, is going to be the game changer. And so I truly believe, Yo, Usyk shouldn't even take that fight. If I was Usyk, I'd be like, nah, but I'd rather just wait for AJ. You know what I'm saying? Because this ain't one of those stay active fights that you want to do. Because even if you win, you're going to take a lot of punishment. 
but I just don't believe he's going to beat Joe Joyce. I have to be honest. So I, my money is on Joe Joyce by knockout. You know what I mean? Come on. Listen, hey, I, Usyk ain't no Daniel Dubois. That's true, too. You know what I'm saying? Usyk ain't no Daniel Dubois. But you, you know, <laughs> when he was when he fought against the car wash owner, he was mm-hmm. a little too spicy. Then with Chisora, <laughs> real scary. You know what I'm saying? Going with his oh, yeah. I know. Shout out to Chad. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Listen, I called him a car wash owner. Well, uh, you know what what school was running that car wash like Franklin Hatchet? <laughs> see money talks. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> Shout out to Witherspoon. Yeah, all them gentlemen, man. Uh, hey, so, G, this may surprise you, but I'm about to be there with you. I'm, I'm in. right no, now, sir. out the window with you, G. No, sir. Oh, work. <laughs> I'm picking <laughs> right now. The fifth floor. You know what I'm saying? I, I'm, I'm not picking right now. You know what I'm saying? Right now. You know what I'm saying? Uh, nah, I'm not. I'm not there yet. But you. But what I will. What I will say is. Uh, Joe Joyce did bring up some really good points. One is they only fought for five rounds. Two, they weren't wearing pro style gloves. Uh, you know, and three, it, it is different now because Joe Joyce has had time to fill into his body. He's six six. Uh, you know, whereas uh, Usyk was Usyk six three six four. Uh, he's not as tall, and you know, he's moved up and physically. Let's just say. I don't see a scenario where Chisora could have bullied Joe Joyce the way that he bullied Usyk for a few rounds. But with that being said, skills pay the bills. They've always paid the bills. They will continue to pay the bills. And Usyk has a lot of skills. So I do think it's a great fight. Um, I felt like their fight um, when they fought, and I think it was like the, that all saw that world series of boxing, whatever it was, was a good fight. I think now both men have reason to be confident. And that's what you like in a fight. For me, I like a fight when both men have reasons to go into the fight being confident. Um, I do think Usyk, I mean, uh, I do think Joe Joyce has a better chance of winning the fight this time than he did last time. So I do think the odds are going to be more favorable for um, Joe Joyce than they were last time. However, I'm not so sure he'll be able to win. But I will say this. If Usyk does beat Joe Joyce, that's a statement win. That's legitimate. And you got to put some respect on Usyk's name if you haven't already. If Usyk beats Joe Joyce, that is solid. That's Chisora. That's past the gate. Then that's beating a legitimate heavyweight contender. So he would have definitely earned his shot at Undisputed if he beats Joe Joyce. If Joe Joyce beats Usyk, you know, same thing. So I think it's a great fight. I look forward to it. I'm not ready to jump out the window with G yet. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, I understand where G's coming from. Let us know how you feel in the comment section. Please like and subscribe. (laughs) Not on Instagram and Twitter. And please check out our podcast on all major streaming services. Who you got? Usyk or you got Joe Joyce? I don't know, man. I'll let you know before the fight. <laughs> I got Usyk decision. Uh, oh, you got Usyk already, True? I got Usyk decision. Oh, oh you jumped out. Usyk they jumped out. Decision. They jumped out. I'm not making my pick yet. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'll guys. say this. Respect the Trill, because he's actually saying Usyk and not Usyk. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm Did I get your short name right? Oh, hold on, hold on. We might have to, wait, wait, we, we got... Y'all both jumping out the window. So this is so. How about this? Why don't we get a push up bet then? This can be settled. Oh, yeah. At um, settled when we go to the gym on a Saturday. Oh, it depends how many push ups we talking about. Just twenty. One hundred. Oh, Trill said a hundo. Hold on, hundred. Said a hundo. Oh, nah, I, I ain't there yet. Oh, gee, you ain't that confident. I do that shit every day, B. <laughs> well, God bless you. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> I'm on so, your honey, your honey's my equivalent of my 25. So <laughs> I got you with 25. I guess, I guess we don't have a push-up bet after all. We got a push-up bet. I'll do 25. Gentlemen bet 25 push-ups. We'll push-up. figure it out. All right, salute. All right, 25. 25 on uh, Joe Joyce versus Usyk.
Yeah, sounds good. Right. <laughs> you take us out, Troy. You took us home already? Yeah, I already took us out. But look, I'm going to take you out once again. Please like, <laughs> subscribe. Check us out on Instagram and Twitter. And please check out our podcast on all major streaming services. The $25, uh, $25, the 25 push-ups is on the line. Usyk versus Joe Joyce. Let us know who you got. It's the Boxing Bros. <laughs>